Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to convert your personal DVDs to MOV format using an app called MacX DVD Reaper Pro. Here, this is the look of the app. So why do you need to convert your DVD to MOV format? Well, there are some reasons that you may want to do so. First of all, it may be because you want to back up your DVD because as you know that physical DVDs are usually prone to scratches so the more scratches you have on your DVD the more difficult it is for you to play that DVD on a DVD drive another reason is that if you back up your DVD you can also play it later on your right phone or store it on your computer or external hard disk or even share those personal videos with friends and family over the internet so with Mac X DVD Ripper Pro all your concerns about your DVD conversion would be a thing of the past. So let me insert my DVD and show you how to convert it to MOV using this app. So after you add your DVD, or if you have DVD image file instead like ISO file, you can click this one here to add it, or even folder, click this one. But mine, I have a physical DVD, so I click on disk here and it automatically select my DVD disc right here. I just leave everything like that and click on OK. And as you can see here, it shows you the output profile. The recommended format that is universally supported is MP4. But for this video, I'm going to show you how to convert the DVD not to MP4 but to MOV. And if you take a look at general profiles here, we have different format that you can convert to. Like you can convert to MP4, iPhone, iPad, Android, DVD video copy, MOV right here. That's the one I'm going to show you how to convert to. M4, V, MP, EG4. And we have a lot more formats that you can convert to. Like you can back up the whole DVD to MKV or clone it to ISO file or only back up the main title content or full title content. You can also convert your DVD to support various devices like Apple devices, Android Pad, Android Mobile, Microsoft device. Sony device or even for YouTube videos, Facebook, Vimeo and other general video format as well. But again for this video, my purpose is only to show you how to convert a DVD to MOV format which is right here. So you just like on it, click on done. In this situation, my DVD only has one title. If you have multiple titles, you can select all of the titles and click on merge here. Merge titles, it will combine all the video together. But because I only have one title, the merge button is deactivated. But if you have more than one titles, it will allow you to merge them together. You can also make some changes to it. For example, you can edit the video first to select the section you want by clicking here. So you can see right here, you can trim or crop the video to the way you want. But for me, I don't want to crop it. I want the whole video. So I just leave it like that. And if you want to make changes to its settings, you click on this setting icon. Icon here. and you can see there are various options and settings that you can change for example video codec frame rates resolution audio option so this is the default format if you want to change for example resolution I want to change it to let's say HD quality 1920 by 1080 I select that click on OK so it will convert this one to the resolution that I selected at the moment. And for destination folder, you can also change it. But currently, I select desktop to be my destination folder. You can also change it by clicking on browse here. Select where you want to save it. Again, I already select desktop. So I just leave it like that. And on this side right here, you can see this is a hardware encoder. So if you click here, it shows that I'm using iMac. My processor is Intel Core i5. And the hardware encoder coding is a yes which means the hardware acceleration engine will help to convert my DVD faster and everything else I would leave it like that even the CPU core here but if you're using newer MacBook Pro with M2 M3 processor with more CPU cores you may want to select the highest one so that it will again help to convert faster so once everything is checked out you can just click on run here to start the conversion process again it will take a while let's sit tight and wait Okay, now it's done. As you can see here, the DVD that we converted to MOV is right here. Let's see how big it is. So the size is 1.2 gigabyte. Let's play it to see how it works.
as you can see that the DVD works well and the quality is also great it's in you take a look at the resolution again it's in 1920 by 1080 that's what we selected earlier as you can see that this app is really beneficial for you to convert any kind of DVDs that you own to MOV or any soft format to store on your computer or your external hard disk quickly and conveniently if you're interested in the app all the links are in the description you can check them out you can also try with the seven day trial versions first to see how it works and if you find the app useful you can always go back to its website to purchase the app genuinely and currently they also have special new year promotions that you can get the lowest or discount prices when you purchase the app so again if you're interested all the links are in the description okay that's it guys thank you so much for watching if you like the video please give us a thumbs up comment down below and subscribe for more useful videos in the future have a great day guys see you in the next video